Ahoy ahoy and uh, welcome back to my channel or if this is your first time watching welcome and uh, you are uh, watching uh, another part of a series of videos uh, taking a closer look at the Paul McCartney Archive Collection uh, to these conditions. Um, before we continue well I uh, got this CD from a box that contains a, a tote bag and yeah, I think it's a Best Buy. And I got this this way. It's like, you know, pr it's probably stacked. Um, the thing is, the um, the packaging doesn't have, uh, you know, cardboard sleeve as you you would typically get today, which would, you know, protect the disc. It's just this. So, yeah, it's easy to damage. And um, uh, fortunately, I was able to save it just a little bit. You could still see some signs of damage but fortunately the CDs were not damaged at all um, and uh, what it has is uh, pipes of peas tote bag that's about 14 by 15 inches um, I will believe these are designed to um, you know carry vinyl records as you go to you know record uh, record store um, Vinyl is, uh, has a bit of a resurgence. Even then, this was uh, I, this was twenty fifteen. So uh, vinyl would have been you know selling a little bit more during that time. Let me just put this um, back into the box. And uh, the uh, tug of war also had a similar version. And uh, by the time you're watching this, you'd probably already see the other or the tug of war video. That I made and the difference between here is if you buy this on retail without the tote bag you'd have a sticker here hype a hype sticker I think that was a transparent sticker that has the track listing um, it doesn't I don't have it here but I have it in the in here so yeah there you go that's a track list yeah okay so here it is and you know the original vinyl well obviously the original vinyl didn't have this strip and it's not debossed like the earlier archive collection releases but the funny thing about this release is this is a wraparound image so you're supposed to have this uh, part you know Paul holding the this on a square package that's no problem you know it's it's just a wraparound thing but here Paul has extra long hands or arms right <laughs> it looked funny I mean <laughs> yeah they, I wish they could have done something to you know in the first place what they could have done is just uh, make this as an OB but I guess you know that that's not an option and probably um, I don't know uh, but anyway we I'm just thankful we had this in a you know concise series as it is so the packaging right there and right there, of course, as with all Paul McCartney archive collection uh, discs, it, the format is uh, gatefold for uh, gatefold pockets for the two discs, a, a die cut window, of course, and yeah, this disc. I this is not part of the packaging, the rice paper sleeve. I just um, you know, I have a sort of a supply of this because I keep myself supplied with this because the um, you know with with digi sleeves or anything that doesn't put the disc on a spindle the, there are sometimes glue residue and stuff like that so that's something you might want to look out for and make sure that you know your disc doesn't touch those parts otherwise you get some glue stuck on the disc face and uh, that, that will make your disc unplayable in those parts um, okay, so unlike the uh, other discs in the series, uh, pipes of pipes of piece doesn't have the glossy matte configuration. It's just a modern uh, glossy finish all the way through, and and this was released at the same time as the tug of war. So I don't know why they didn't uh, make this a uh, you know consistent look. But you also notice that the seats are different. This is a, I don't know, uh, is it, I'm not sure if this, this is an actual Van Gogh painting or might have been, might have been in the credits, but I didn't, obviously I didn't do my research there, but 
yeah there it, there it is and then there's another in here that's also different or I think it's the same seat uh, they just yeah it's the same seat they just put the different um, stuff in there like for example there's a little detail here that uh, has a tug of war right there then of course this is the uh, hype sticker and um, I saved it I put it on a backing paper for sticker so I could put actually put this in any uh, well anywhere if um, I wanted to yeah it's it's not just stuck on a piece of plastic or whatever I have a link on the video and how, how how I did that so just uh, check the description should be there so lyrics of course and a bunch of um, photos I don't I'm thinking if I'm trying to remember if they did the same thing because because in the um, band on the run disc they um they had Polaroids but this what it was actually in a poster and then I don't know if they did it the same here so that's Linda right there this is the this is the cover I think that he she's holding a I think Linda is holding a prototype cover right there because you can see Paul's this is what it should have been on the vine on the cover right there so of course Ringo and I was I think so bad was in this album was it oh uh, yeah so bad so if you see the music video uh, for so bad the Ringo is in there and of course that's Michael Jackson before he bought the entire Beatles catalog right there and I think that is a study of um, every other photo and there's a little Polaroid of the same thing right there that's nice and then it's another Michael Jackson song right there it's really nice very um, 80s uh, Jackson and there's uh, George Martin of course right there and there's the um, track list lots of demos not necessarily there, there's a, a remix of uh, say 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 uh, I think that version oh yeah this is the version that uh, had uh, the parts uh, Paul's and Michael Jackson's parts reversed so the, the on the single the part the original version where uh, Paul the parts that Paul were singing were sung by Michael in that 2015 mix while uh, the reverse is the same for you know vice versa for uh, Michael to John, uh, to Paul so here we go uh, pipes of peace and uh, do hang around I will post more um, I do have a uh, quite a few videos schedule scheduled or will be scheduled um, that uh, would take a look at the, the other albums in the series so uh, yeah in the meantime be good